Abs Catcher of Geology 101. Yeah. The L I mean, we use this term thrown around LCT pegmatites, and, yeah. and it's actually lithium, cesium, and tantalum, right? Yeah. What's the significant LCT pegmatites? Um, everyone just goes, oh, you've got a pegmatite, you must have lithium, right? Mm -hmm. It's the, really is the, it's the, the chemistry that makes them up. Those are the, the LCT ones. Those are the, those are the minerals that deposit out in a certain phase or fractionation of yep. that particular. From the granite. And from the granite. Yeah. So uh, there's a lot of, uh, there's a lot of uh, um, work being done to try and better understand what those distances are supposed to be are they, from the, from the granites and. Some of them, are, some of them are sort of. We've got a buffer zone of about three kilometres set up around that granite, where we think is perspective for that. It also comes down to the host, um, where they're being in place. But really, it's that LCT fraction of the fluid that's coming out and deposited is the portion that is going to be rich in lithium, cesium, and tantalum. Mm -hmm. So they, those are the three elements. Yeah, the that type of pegmatites yeah, you want. Those are the type of yeah. things that you want yeah. in Western Australia. The and I think the issue with those I have is that you you only get the answer when you work backwards. And when you come from the other side, it's a bit of a hit and miss, right? Yeah. Why you get that is still a hit and miss, I think. Um, yeah, I don't think, yeah, no, I don't think the model is fully understood yet. And uh, I don't think e any individual pegmatite is the same. They're all different. And that's the hard bit, is your yeah. off-take. Off-take is uh, having to deal with a product which is different from every single one of them.